I swear to God, this place is always busy. Hard workers. Moving that nice product for you guys, 2023. You know what time it is. I know I haven't had a chance to get around and do a full walkthrough video, but Red Apple Fireworks is breaking ground on their new facility. If you guys haven't been keeping up in the news, this is where they're breaking ground for their new warehouse facility. Now, Doug had mentioned this to me a few years ago. Didn't know exactly what they had planned, but you guys can now see the fruition because here it is. This is the new warehouse for Red Apple Fireworks. You don't see any porta potties out here. This is all going to be firework territory. And if you guys are familiar with their Valdosta store, this will be much bigger than that location. So I may have to bring my scooter or my golf court cart to get around because that place is just going to be gigantic. But without further ado, you know what time it is. Let's get into it. And we're doing things much differently this year. guys here we are red apple fireworks we're going to tour the store it's going to be oh man they got stuff all the way up there now jesus we always got something going on all right so this is the checkout section over here it looks like they have the other side blocked off right now let's do a quick walkthrough and then we'll take a look and focus on some of the key prices so it looks like they took down their Enola Gay smoke grenades from over here and they moved them over there. Hey, how you guys doing? Hi, good, you? Good. That's where they keep all their shells in the back. Oh, wait a minute. They moved the shells up here. Oh, nice. Moving stuff around on me. Oh, yeah. You know we got to get some of those geishas. So those are some of the best shells and the most affordable shells in all of Pahrump right now. You guys better jump on it before the prices change. $86. You guys have seen the other videos. Uh, they've all been like 120 something, 130, 140. And man, some of you guys used to rag on their prices, but gee. What a difference a day makes. All right, let's walk around this way. All right, so they moved. They just did a swap of room, so it looks like they moved all their assortments back, back here. Cobra boxes. I got unboxing videos on all these here. The Panda. We got unboxing videos on a lot of this stuff in here, and we shot most of it. That's the case I need to pick up. The one with the bamboo bombs. Pandas, I still got a couple of cases of those left. Chromos, $77, Jesus, man. That's, that's the banger right there. But to find those geishas priced at 86, you're not gonna beat that. You guys know I love me some geishas. All right, giant panda boxes, chromas. We got some bombas, 85 bucks. 
top of the line shells. This is not cheap stuff. You guys been out to Red Apple Demo Night? Oh, whistling shells, 76. You guys know all these whistle with nice special effects. I've shot off a couple of boxes of these in my previous shows, you guys will be impressed with all these. All right, we got trophy bombs. Hey, how's it going? Oh, definitely, thank you. Man, you guys got the best Dylan Towns on the shelves right now. Oh, heck yeah. All right, so for right now, it looks like they got this door blocked off, but it'll probably be open up, obviously, for closer to we get Memorial Weekend, demo night, and stuff like that. I'm sure all these doors will be open. So let's see, is there anything here we want to spotlight? We got our same bottle rockets here. And Red Apple, they do wholesale, which is by the case. And then, of course, they also do retail as well. 18 bucks. Significant price drop from what we've seen the past couple of years, you know, due to COVID. But that's other, otherwise, that's still a standard uh, great price, you know, pre-COVID prices. 27 bucks for the unit. I think I still got a case of those I haven't lent. All right, we're not gonna mess with that right now. Um, this is the Jumbo Fountain, so we just left Blackjack. They were priced at $100. What do they have priced here? $45.86. Red Apple Fireworks. Always coming in the clutch. Man, that's a 60 bucks price difference by retail. All right, so last time they had all of their 500 gram fountains over here, so it looks like they have moved them somewhere but we will find them and it also looks like they've moved a lot of the stuff away from the walls here so i don't know what they're planning on doing with that maybe overstock <coughs> excuse me maybe some overstock they're going to put back there because they're always hustling things in through this door and uh we want to find our 500 gram fountains because you guys know i'm a sucker for those love them well you know what that's a 500 gram fountain there so where are the rest of them Now, if you guys are familiar with the Spring Flame, uh, Spartan Scream, um, and those fountains, I do have a special video coming up on those. Been waiting to do it because I haven't had, got around to uh, edit, but uh, there's some information as far as a comparison video I want you guys to pay attention to uh, when I upload that video. So uh, this is a Mega Banger Killer Fountain, all 500 grams. This one is 158, so. Uh, that's probably their most expensive uh, fountain I've ever seen at Red Apple. So wonder how it performs. Then, of course, we have the Ignite Spark. I did a video on that. Nine bucks. Not bad. You guys know I love me some video games. So we got an arcade set over here. Nice. Panda box. I got unboxing videos on all this. Now, a lot of my other firework content uh, previous to me starting this particular channel, Keel Boom Daikin, is on Keel Daikin. So I do have some other firework videos and a playlist on my Keel Daikin uh, channel as well. Most of those will be before 2021 and so forth. All right, apple bombs. These are our giant Roman candle aisles here. $18 for the unit. Some of the other places we're charging like $33, $30, whatever. We got $17. 20 14 23 $19, $6, $10. Four fifty. All right, 
right, so they moved some things before everything was on the other side of the aisle. Whistle spliffs, uh, if you guys know who CZ Celtic is, he turned me on to these. He loved those, I wanted to test one of those out. I got a video on it, you guys will love the whistle spliffs. Really loud, if you really love it, definitely get the case on this one. And the case is going for 200 bucks, not bad. So there are 10 inside the box, so that's not too bad. And then plus, you get the unit for 23. I loved them, it was, it was, it was really good uh, battery missile. What is this, Liberty Bazooka? $28, what is this? Blue, okay, Blue Barrage Camels. I may have to hold off on candles this year because I got a bunch of them I need to burn through. I still got tons of um, some of those neon 120, uh, what, 228 shot Roman candles and stuff. All right, where are my 16,000 firecracker rolls? I'm gonna need some of those. And I'm also gonna need, I'm gonna need me a dolly. See what's the price of this? Seventy-seven dollars for the blast firework case. All right, we'll skip this out for now. We'll come back to it. Sixty-two. Now um, I know closer to Memorial Weekend and Demo Night, Red Apple Fireworks will start getting more inventory and in stock. But for the most part, they've been stocked all year. Um, they will have some new items coming in. And as far as I know, some of the performers or names have changed on a couple of their items. But I'll get some more information and relay that to you guys later today on how that's going to work. All right. So Yowza 4866. And then keep in mind, please, you know, a lot of this stuff, you know, for the most part, a lot of this stuff changes chemical compound. This is why sometimes... Some people say, hey, I shot this firework one year. The next year I got it. It really didn't perform. But there was another brand of firework that performed much better. In terms of years, you got to shoot it that year to know how that product is performing. Because I bought Chromas one year. I think that was 2018, 2019. Didn't like those. And then 2020s were much better and I didn't get those. But the Geishas were much better that year. And I, I know the 2020 Geishas, just to give you guys an example, were much better than the 2021s and 2022s. So I love those. In fact, I think I may have a box left and I may have to save it. And fortunately, a lot of people didn't get the 2020 geishas because they had sold out before Memorial Weekend and a lot of places ran out of fireworks. And I think that was the only time Red Apple ran out of their own signature series stuff in the store because everything was pretty much gone. And they had to order from some other places. But all right, uh, we have Cat Jack, 60 shots, $71, Catzilla. And I love their branding on all their fireworks. Really catches your attention. We got some fuse here. This is a slow burning fuse here for a good show. Let's see if this aisle is available. Got Cat Kong, 115 for an allotment of shells. All right, sushi box. If you guys remember these. It's $23. Okay. Jet fuel. Luchadores Extremos. And you guys, I have videos on all this stuff here on the channel if you guys want to check out the playlist. Bunny Rabbit. One thousand shot candle cascade in seven colors. All right, so these are like your smaller grams and two hundred gram fountains over here. 23 bucks. All right, let's go take a look at more of the heavier items. This was the aisle we skipped. All righty. K 
Cata box. What's the price of this? One ninety nine. Jesus, man, that's a good deal. So if you guys, it's right now, uh, middle of April, beginning, middle of April, however you want to look at it. Uh, this is the best time to get your fireworks. Do not think prices are going to go down at any point in time. I know people like to wait till the last minute. And then, you know, you're hearing people complain about prices and stuff. But these are the best prices that you're pretty much going to get right now. So just get them. If you have a storage shed, whatever the case might be, stack up. Get them by the case. Smartest thing to do, $49.99. So if you guys have noticed, compared to some of the other stores in the area, uh, they're 50 dollars cheaper 50 percent off so 49.86 for this 500 gram fountain i mean a 500 gram cake 39.99 and the average price for the other ones on a retail level are all about uh a hundred dollars it's astronomical 86 63 57 39, Jesus, 40, 48. And if you talk to the guys who really know, who know their stuff, you'll know Red Apple Mate. Some really, really good stuff. I love this one here. It's one of my favorites, high output. $51 for the unit. Good stuff. That is a high performing cake right there. Ganja boxes. 38, 51. Uh, where's the price on that one? I don't even see it. Skyscraper 30 shots, $49.99 or $49. Yeah, I might have to get a couple boxes. How much is that freaking case? $2.29? Not too bad. I don't think I need a case though. Big box bombs. 47. Jesus, man. Look at these prices. 43. Sorry. Okay. Doing okay? Oh, yeah. Okay. Thank you. 37 bucks. $64. Lit AF. That was first demo last year. Came in at the last minute for Demo Night 2022. Viva Mexico. Again, you guys can watch all the videos on this on either the Red Apple uh, Fireworks YouTube channel or you can watch it on mine because got it all up so uh this one okay inferno can't remember this one should be on the channel too don't remember the name offhand but looks familiar 45 dollars put that one up there wavelength compound cake love that one 174 about for that one. That was uh, right up with Fireworks' first compound cake. You basically tape them together, whatever, light one, and 500 grams each gives you a thousand grams of uh, powder. $30 for the unit. We have the Star Cats. I've shot this one personally, and also uh, you guys can see other demo videos um, as well. These actually have some huge, nice bores on here uh, for the caliber. So you get 31 shots each. Uh, you know, lighten up all of these as a finale set. Uh, they're all different. You know, they're not like the same four cakes that are in a box. So you get a nice show with a combination of different effects in each one. Buddha Barrage Ultra Barrage Finale. Ah, Sunflower Bomb. So this was um, a top seller a few years ago. Probably still holds up right now. I'm just saying, but a couple years ago, I think it was 2021. Everybody went at this one. This was one of their top selling finale sets. I mean, like literally, like after demo, they were gone. 
and people had to wait to get these back in. So you guys are looking for a good set. Again, these are individual finale set. Definitely go with that one. You won't, you won't go wrong with it. It'll wake up everybody. So Killer Moth, we got videos on that one. That one's going for 139, so it's on sale right now, 20 bucks off. According to Mike, these are the loudest shells in the store. Um, I don't know too many people that's actually bought this Panda box. Uh, this was used to be a thousand bucks. I think it was like thousand bucks, six hundred. Now I can get it on sale for five hundred. So it's on sale right now. And that's the only way you're gonna get those shells is in that case. All right, now over here they normally have all their accessories. They have all their T-shirts and everything. I think they moved them over here. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. I think they used to have their bottle rockets and stuff, but they moved it. You guys can get your red apple shirts. I remember when I first got mine, uh, people thought I used to work here. Oops. Because when I got mine, that was back in like 2014, something like that, and then they sold out. So then they got them back in stock. So there you guys have them. Then, of course, we got some prosumer items there. We got our shells. I mean, not shells, I'm sorry. We got our mortar racks. And Boomin' Spring Special. So if you guys are familiar with these, you light them and it's, you know, it's kind of like that pooping dog scenario. And some of the prices on their novelties, eight, eight, five, whatever the case might be, two, two. So as you can see, they have a, a, a different assortment of novelties compared to some of the other stores. Like, you know, like this little stuff. I mean, like a lot of the stores used to all have, you know, like these motorcycles and uh, little race cars and stuff. But that's kind of what I was looking for, the other ones. But they don't have any of that kind of stuff in stock. It's that, in fact, they looked a little bit low. So, you know, you got your little tanks here. And these are all good for the kids. You know, it's not a lot of kick to them. Uh, they are unique. This is one of the things I love about fireworks is this little kind of stuff here because you always light it wondering what kind of effect it's going to put out. So if you're curious like me in terms of, you know, you're buying a product and looking for, you know, some uniqueness to it, that's always the way to go. Then, of course, we have the disco flashes. I didn't see that in some of the other places, so they definitely have those here. And uh, again, Enola Gay is the only uh, place, Red Apple is the only place that has the Enola Gays in stock. So I've got videos of all that here. And then of course, Fuse as well. We got plenty of Fuse here in the store. I wish they would carry the Quick Fuse. Not too many places have them. You usually have to order that from like Pyro Boom or Cannon Fuse or something like that. But you know, uh, all you consumers out there just looking to shoot fireworks and have some fun, uh, get all of your assortment, fuse them together. You know, don't try to do the whole hour show. Just try to light as many as you can. You know, that way you get more bang for your buck. And uh, you got it all here there and get all hooked up. Morning Glory. All right, now we have all of our gender reveal party poppers and stuff and confetti cake cannons. I've shot off a few of these as well and they make a mess. So if you guys have a neighbor you don't like, just take a few steps in their direction. Make sure the wind's blowing in their direction and just pop it off. But don't tell them I told you. All right, and then we have this cool thing. Now this, I'm really interested to know what this does because I lit this and didn't have too much of a success. So I have to figure it out. I think they light individually some type of way but very unique i bought it last year so i'm really interested to really see what it does and then of course you guys are familiar with the gun types and the sword type fireworks these are pretty cool this is the chainsaw and i believe this one is new for 2023 
uh, the Zed Shredder. I don't believe they were here last year, but uh, it's another good firework. Um, I don't think, well, these are classified as fountains. I don't think these are classified as fountains, but you know, you just hold them and they have their own special effect that they do. But these are fountains. A lot of people, originally when these came out, we all thought these were sparklers, but no, these are handheld fountains. There's a wedding sparkler. I got a video on this. I think this one lasts about two to three minutes, if I do recall. So, and of course, wedding poppers. And all of these here are legal in California. You can even have them shipped to California. And then, of course, uh, Red Apple Fireworks does ship across the United States. Make sure you check your local laws and regulations. But if you live in California, you can get all the party, party poppers, sparklers, and all this kind of stuff here uh, shipped to you. Nobody gives a crap. All right, ladybugs. Oh, these are different. These are new. See, normally they have that plastic on them, but these are different. Seven bucks. I wonder if the performance on those are different or they just changed the uh, outer shell. Because normally it's like a paper wrapped or whatever. Now these are, this is all plastic. And these are the smokes. I think these are new. These are neon smoke bombs. I think these are new. I'm gonna have to demo those. You know, Legays, I love some of those. And then of course, these are your regular smokes uh, here. So most of these all, I think I've shot them all, all perform well. Uh, six minute smokes, they do, they do pretty well too. Got videos on all of that. And of course, there's other channels that have them, so whatever's your fancy. Five minute mammoth smokes, those are always great. But um, all in all, guys, this is what Red Apple Fireworks looks like for 2023 so far. And um, we'll pick up a couple of these. <laughs> God, I love my geishas. We'll see how they perform. Most of those always have the same consistency and stuff. You know, you can't go wrong with any of those, but. Uh, you have fun while you like, but this is what you guys can expect right now for this year. Uh, they have some new things coming up. We have Demo Night coming up in the next few days. The Red Apple Fireworks, I believe that is May the 6th, right after Cinco de Mayo. So make sure you guys have your hats on, be ready to party, bring your binoculars, bring your camcorders, family fun environment. They always have, you know, some food ready for everybody, some food trucks, other nice fun of excitement and it's all in fun we're gonna have a great time uh this year and uh, make sure you guys start stocking up right now please 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 don't wait till the last minute don't wait till the last minute i mean i understand if some of you only can only hold so much but if you want the best deals get them now and buy by the case so with that being said i'll catch you guys later peace out have a good day bye-bye